What's up? My name is Technoba here for Server Pro and welcome to our Valheim tutorial series. In this series, I'll show you how to set up and run a Valheim server. This video covers managing your permitted or banned list to choose exactly who and who can't join and play on your server. It gives you ultimate control over the player base on your server, even if everyone has the password. So as you can see, currently I'm playing on the server and I'm allowed to do everything I usually would. In order to allow or disallow players to join the server, all that we have to do is get their Steam ID so that we can ban them or add them to the permitted list. Super simple. All that we have to do is get into game and then hit F2 to bring up this menu over here. You'll see a list of all of the players on the server as well as their Steam IDs next to them. This Steam ID is what we need. If you don't like doing it this way, then there's another way to do it. The other most simple way to do it is to visit the player's Steam page. Mine is over here. As you can see, I've got a custom URL at the very top, ID, followed by a custom name. However, if you see slash profile followed by a bunch of numbers, those numbers are a Steam ID. Simply copy them from there. Otherwise, you can simply copy the link, head across to Google and search for Steam ID Finder. Click any one of the links, then paste in their link and click Submit. After doing this, you'll see a bunch of info and what you're looking for is the Steam64 ID. I'll copy mine from here. Awesome, so now that we have the ID of a player we'd like to permit or ban from our server, what do we do with it? Well, the first thing you want to do is head over to your My Servers page on your Server Pro dashboard. Then navigate across to the control panel for your VPS server and select the Valheim service from the very top of your screen. If you want to learn how to create a new VPS or you're not entirely sure what it is, click the I in the top right hand corner of this video or check the description down below. That'll take you to a video on how to get started. As well, you'll also find a link in the top right and in the description down below on setting up and creating your own Valheim server using Server Pro's VPS service. It's all super simple to get going. Regardless, when you get to here, simply head across to your Server Files section and we'll be looking for the config folder. Inside of here, you'll see a banned list and a permitted list. Users that are placed into the permitted list will be the only people allowed to join the server. Users placed into the banned list will no longer be allowed to join the server. All you have to do is paste their ID into here and save the file for it to take effect. As you can see, my screen went black and if we head back into Valheim, you can see I was disconnected. This is simply because I added my Steam ID to the banned players list and I can no longer play on the server. But let's take ourselves out of the banned list, save the file and place ourselves on the permitted list instead. After doing this, we'll only be allowed to join the server and nobody else will even if they have the correct password. Only users on this list over here will be able to join the server. So let's quickly test it to see if we can join. I'll go ahead and connect to the server, then enter the password when prompted, as I've now unbanned myself and I'm on the permitted list. There we go. I'm now in the server and I'm allowed to play. But let's say that I wasn't allowed to join the server, I'm not in the permitted list. Let's quickly head back to the file here and change the Steam ID of who's allowed to join the server so that it's not mine. I'll save it and as you can see, will eventually be kicked from the server and we won't be allowed to play. There we go. Let's go ahead and try to rejoin. Even if I enter the correct password here, you'll see a message like this saying banned. If you have anyone in the permitted list over here, every player on the planet will be banned from your server except for the ones in this list. However, if this file is empty, everyone can connect to your server. If you'd like to ban players, use the banned list, place an ID in here, save and they'll no longer be allowed to join your server. It's super simple and these two files give you ultimate control over who plays on your server. More so the permitted list than the banned list as you'll only allow specific people even if they have the correct password. It's super simple and easy to use. But anyways, that's about it for this tutorial video. Hopefully you found it useful. If you have any video suggestions, leave them in the comments below. If you're having issues with anything, contact our support team. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!